In this equation, we have K plus N2, and it's giving us this K3N. This is potassium plus nitrogen gas. So to balance the equation, let's count the atoms up on each side. We have one potassium atom, two nitrogen atoms, and then we have on the product side, three potassium and just one nitrogen. Probably the best thing to do when you get an odd number like this is to change it to an even number. And we can do that by putting a coefficient of two in front of the K3N three times two, that'll give us six. So we have our even number, and then the two goes to everything. So two times the one nitrogen, that'll give us two nitrogen atoms. But now it's fairly easy. We need six potassium atoms over here. We'll put a coefficient of six, one times six, that equals six. The nitrogens, they're already balanced. In this equation, the potassium, that would be a metal, it'd be a solid, the nitrogen, N2 is a gas, and the product, the K3N, potassium nitride, that would be a solid. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for K plus N2. Thanks for watching.